I live in Bedfordshire. I've been married for nearly 40 years. I have two grown-up children. My daughter got married earlier this year and we're expecting our first grandchild early next year. I worked in the corporate world for about 42 years um, and retired uh, six years ago. I do like travelling. Me and my wife have had some very good holidays over the past few years. We like safari. My interests are photography. I use photography to, to capture what we've seen and what we've done. I've always uh, been careful with money. I, I suppose I've always been lucky. Being in the corporate world, I always had a regular pay packet. Because I was only starting to come into money and wealth as you get older, which most people do, you then have to be sensible with your money to ensure that uh, you can plan your future. The cautious funds that I have for Toolney enabled me to do that, but whilst keeping a, a look on it and, and regular meetings with the financial planner enables me to keep track and, uh, and take that forward with a level, of, a level of security. There will be times when he will contact me to discuss something about pensions or ISAs, so if I have a question, which I did two months ago about something, I'm able to speak to the financial planner and say, here, I've just read about this, how does this affect me? And he will talk to me about that on what perhaps I should do or what it actually means. There is a link between sound financial management and what you're trying to achieve in your aspirations. And my aspirations being making the most of my family, enjoying uh, going on nice holidays, safaris and things like that. Uh, and having a reasonable confidence that that would be able to continue. So I can see us spending more time on holidays. With our grandchild coming along as well, I'm sure there'll be a, a lot of um, time spent with he or she. Memories for me are probably the most precious thing that we can have as human beings in terms of having good times, enjoyable times, reminiscing over the people you've met, the trips you've made overseas and all that sort of thing. So that's probably quite important to me rather than probably the materialistic things in life. 